Hello there, colors. I have a wonderful story to tell you today. A story about Tibra the zebra. Colors, would you like to help me tell the story? <laughs> Great. Meet Tibra the zebra. One morning, Tibra got out of her bed and went to look at herself in the mirror and discovered that, wow, all of her stripes had disappeared. Tibra was very sad. Suddenly, Rexy the dog walked by. Rexy, Rexy, I lost my stripes, cried out Tibra the zebra. Have you seen them by any chance? No, said Rexy. Rexy noticed that Tibra was a little sad. So, he collected a few spots from his fur and gave them to her. Here, Tibra, take these. Instead of stripes, you'll have spots. Thank you, Rexy. You're such a great friend. But I prefer my stripes, said Tibra. Tibra then saw Gogo the Flamingo. Gogo, Gogo, I lost my stripes. Have you seen them by any chance? No, no, I haven't seen them, said Gogo the Flamingo. Gogo saw that Tibra was very sad, so he collected a few of his feathers and gave them to her. Here, Tibra, take these. Instead of stripes, you'll have feathers. <laughs> That's sweet of you. Thank you, Gogo. But I want my stripes, said Tibra. Maybe Porky the porcupine knows. Porky, Porky, I lost my stripes. Have you seen them by any chance? Asked Tibra. No, I haven't, said Porky. Porky noticed that Tibra was very sad, so he decided to offer her a few of his quills. Here, Tibra, take these. Instead of your stripes, you'll have some quills. Hmm, thank you, Porky, but I miss my stripes. I miss my stripes so much, said Tibra. Then Kent the Elephant passed by. Here's Kent the Elephant, everyone shouted. He looks a little different today. And everyone called out, Hey, Kent has on some stripes. Hey, Kent, what lovely stripes you have, said Tibra. Really? I'm not so happy with them, said Kent. I don't think they suit me. Would you like to have my stripes? I would love to. Thank you, Kent the Elephant. I'm so very happy, said Tibra the Zebra. You are all so wonderful. Did you enjoy the story colors? So did I. See you next time.